In Luke chapter 8, Jesus told this parable. A sower went out to sow his seed. As he sowed, some fell along the path. It was trampled on, and the birds of the sky devoured it. Other seed fell on the rock. When it grew up, it withered away, since it lacked moisture. Other seed fell among thorns. The thorns grew up with it and choked it. Still other seed fell on good ground. When it grew up, it produced fruit, a hundred times what was sown. As he said this, he called out, Let anyone who has ears to hear, listen. And then to his disciples, he explained that the parable meant this, The seed is the word of God. The seed along the path are those who have heard, and then the devil comes and takes away the word from their hearts, so that they may not believe and be saved. And the seed on the rock are those who, when they hear, receive the word with joy. Having no root, these believe for a while, and fall away in time of testing. As for the seed that fell among thorns, those are the ones who, when they have heard, go on their way, and are choked with worries, riches, and pleasures of life, and produce no mature fruit. But the seed in the good ground, these are the ones who, having heard the word with an honest and good heart, hold on to it, and by enduring, produce fruit. I've heard this passage preached on so many times, and usually they focus on each one of these different kinds of soils. And, and that's all well and good, but the point of Jesus' parable is simply this. Be the good soil. Be the good soil. Be the one who holds on to the word of God. Be the one who produces fruit after hearing the word of God. Share his word with others. Love other people. Don't let it just go in one ear and out the other. Don't just believe it. Live according to it. It's super simple. Be the good soil. God bless you. We'll see you again tomorrow.